Alright, what is up everybody? This is Edu Troy bringing you another coming night of Battle Ride Wars. Let's play Chronicle Mode, let's go! We are now playing as Fies. ホスオルフェノク、Alright, so basically we're going to be playing as Fives, if your case, well, all of that would have told you. I'm still not understanding what the hell this is, I know it's a power-up thing. Um, I think I bought an upgrade for a wizard, I'm not sure what the hell I bought. I, or those are upgrades for battle modes and whatnot. <clears throat> or just power-ups, I guess. Ooh, we're gonna be playing as Fives today! Yeah, XC Charge 555 five, five, standing by complete. We're gonna whoop some ass. Yeah, we know. You don't have a dream. I mean, I have a dream, but you wouldn't mind protecting others' dreams all the other time. So let's just go. Yeah, that's that thing about the. Fies pointing. It fires far away. It doesn't fire right at the target. You usually got a lock on, but because they don't give a lock on option for regular, um, like bio riders. Or Anywho, it took me a while to figure out the whole, uh, well, not really a while, it just, yeah, it took, <laughs> it took me a while to figure out how to do this whole, I used the, um, Vice Sparkle look, <laughs> she charged thingy, yeah. That's right, it's called the Vice Sparkle. I don't understand why the hell they did that. But, when I tried to use it, it kept launching the um, thingy vortex, but no slashes. But then I figured out you were supposed to um, press, the, uh, press the finisher button again, and then, and then you'll do the slashes. But, of course, I didn't know that in this game <laughs> until later on, which you will find out. Speaking of which, yes, there will be, there will be going back to gameplay, you know, they, you know, going back and uh, finishing the stuff that I, you know, I was supposed to do and thought it was, and I thought that uh, it would be one at a time so I don't knock on other riders, but uh, before I uh, did commentary for this video, I was just playing and I just unlocked Deno, so yeah, you will be seeing Deno. Soon. Don't know when, but soon. You will see him soon. <laughs> Just spamming the pump. Just spamming the XC charge. I did not get what the hell that was. Did someone gain the ability to shoot webs at the spam man? But I will say this. How to clear people out and piss them off? Like that. Fies blast. Too bad the um Fies uh blaster to charge rider kick isn't the finisher. It's the it's the Fies blade XC charge. But this the Fies blaster attack charges, so that's a good thing. I'll punch the shit out of you, I'm a boxer. Kiba Yuji, come here so I can punch you in the face. So in case you guys never watch Fives, it's all about Orphanox and basically three gears. But movies and all the other fun stuff, uh, revealed that there were more gears created by a company called Smart Brain, which has a lot to do with the Orphanox, but what had happened was, well, the whole thing revolved around that, that girl Taku is with, that slowly, I think, slowly they start falling in love, you know, that mushy gushy crap, and then you got the high school guy, total D-bag, aka we all know who it is, Kaiser. Trying to, 
trying to steal a woman, man. You trying to steal this woman? That's not right. Except Delta, that's the funny thing. Delta already might have already gotten a check. That's really funny. <laughs> Every time I kept throwing that, I was wondering why why am I not doing the slashes? Like, shouldn't it be like automatic? But I found out it's not automatic, you have to do it manually, which is cool. Yeah, I'm trying to shoot the vice pointer. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, I'm a little tired. Not forward to tired. I have to go to work today. Anywho. But for some weird reason, when he shoots the Fies Pointer... <laughs> now, this is the thing. It takes two Fies Pointer and he charges to destroy that. Which is cool with me. I want to destroy those sons of bitches fast. And besides, these guys, they die whenever um it's destroyed. Whenever they're trying to guard it. But they failed at that. Because they could have stopped me from charging the shit out of it. Oh, right, token review, sorry. <laughs> uh, mine got lost there. TV Nihon released a Kiko Ranger episode 8 yesterday. Seemed to have uploaded that about episode 7. Episode 8 is basically going to be about whale. They're trying to find the Shogun in real life after finding out that Shogun will be able to go into the into the delusional world. Not only that, but they found out that the guy in the karaoke bar is is actually the leader. So, so what happens? Encounter a new monster, but it's not a new one. It's an old one, but what? But he's been revamped. So instead of it being girl, it's a guy. But instead of that, apparently, it made a reference to Geki Ranger. Not only that, but he did attacks that were famous by Sentai enemies in the past, like 80s. 90s and so forth. You did work for the hurricane. Uh, Commanders and enemies are all the other stuff. <sighs> Sorry. Anywho, let's see what else happened. So they meet an old suit actor. Oh my God! It's a bomb! It's a bomb! Yeah. So they meet an old suit actor who played many villains in you know, past Sentai's. Many, many, many villains, and he loved dying in passion. And the weird thing was when Akiba Red and the uh, and the uh, monster were going at it, <laughs> he started telling him about um. What is that telling him? It's more along the lines of they set up a movie background, like the sunset and all. And <laughs> What had happened was he, he basically fell for it. For it. Because, uh, he fell for it. <laughs> you missed. You missed. How do you miss? There we go. Now we get somewhere. Now we get somewhere. Yeah, I don't get it. It's hitting the ground. It's not even hitting the target it's hitting the ground <laughs> and yet it's still going for the kick it's weird though but I guess it's okay <sighs> oh getting up nose to nose you know that this fight's gonna get serious although those two were trying to be best friends because they both found out their orphan ox <laughs> oh that was a major spoiler Anywho, besides um, I keep arranging the release, there was also Zuna said I kill you, Jack release, and the Kamen Rider Wizard Hyper Battle video. Well, I don't want to talk about the Hyper Battle video because it was a, it was a showy, showtime. Oh, and uh, I need to make a comment on uh, Kabuto Riser uh, in episode seven of Akiba Ranger when you said let's make the showy. I'm showy. You don't take Go Kai Red, Captain Marvelous's line and make it into your own. That's break your character. Get out of here with that. Nine will have about a DVD. Well, you guys are just gonna have to go find that. Too much randomness to explain. Honestly. Too much. 
was too much. But Zuda said that kill you, Jer. I will explain. Now, kill you blue. Goes to, kill you blue goes to a work, goes to a place where his best friend from high school works. Now, the best friend is pissed off at the fact that he gave up on his dream from being a businessman too. Even in the jack of all trades, where he's at right now, it's a little bit whatever the hell it is. It's basically a Now, Kyoyu's sister apparently is starting, to, is starting to slowly figure out each member of the Sentai is. each member of Kyoyu's is Kyoyu's. Slowly. She already accused King of being Kyoyu Red. She already starting to figure it out, but to get the help that is needed, it was decided by Ami that, of course, Uchi would be used. Speaking of Uchi, in the beginning, he went to go confront none other than the gold, because he hates his guts, and he made it very clear, you are my enemy. You are my freaking mortal enemy, and I hate your guts. Oh, I just love the ending background thingy of Mortal Bob that always comes out. Whew. There's just so many things, you know? So many, just so many things that I like about this game. It's just, it's really authentic and I really do like it. I'm free from the chains of evil. I am Fize. You see this, Navi? You see this? This is what I'm gonna punch you with. Continuing on, of course, we're gonna play as Fies. Or not. I don't. Hell. I was thinking, huh. Okay, okay, screw it. We're gonna play as Fies. Sorry about that. But when I recorded this, I was like, huh. Sorry, I just wanted to do that. <laughs> I just wanted to do that though. Someone. It wouldn't hurt to do that. Just spam it over and over, just to hear um, <laughs> just to hear Kitaros do that is funny. And who guess which rider we're saving this time? It's I'll give you a hint. Uh, it better be a good one. Uh, uh, um. No fear, no pain. There you go. Take a guess in the comments below who will save me. Or if you want to. Damn it, Kuga, you spoiled it already. Damn you, Honor Kuga. Yeah, I kept doing that. If the frames are dropping, I'm sorry. Still gonna need to buy that. I saw it Walmart, but they sold out, which is shit for me, so I need to figure this out. Yeah, this is the most weirdest thing they had me doing on the side of a freaking mountain. They had me going back and forth, back and forth, between one end to the other end, and it just got really easy of a mission. Save Kuka, destroy them. Oh, look, Paul the Cat! Knock his ass out. Paul's not gonna be happy when I say that. Knock his ass out. <laughs> Ready. Ready. <laughs> Fail? I failed at that, okay? Yeah, I will admit I failed. <laughs> Sorry, it was an aiming thing. It takes them out. <laughs> Sorry, can you help doing the fire thing? Can you help it? Yeah, right there, I figured it out right there. Apparently after you hit him, you gotta sh you gotta keep rapidly pressing the buttons to open your new. I just keep doing the XC charge kick because I don't wanna hit somebody with this. Kuga, you're a fucking bitch, you know that? You made me run back and forth 
and get a lot of exercise. Up a freezing mountain, man. I can't wait to whoop your ass. <clears throat> yeah, this, uh, this part of the mission gets really annoying. Because you're going to have to drive back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It's a small little <clears throat> map. It's a small ass map, that's all I got to say. Dude, I love to do that. Yo. I can't aim with the damn point. It's pretty sad. I want to aim with the pointer so I can at least keep doing the whole fight from the Smash Rider kick. Alright, 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 again. <clears throat> Anywho, about the kick. So his friend apparently is into robotics, but the thing is, he forgot about why he went into robotics to follow his dream. Of course, it was to help people, so... What happened was, the gold, the boss army, gave him a chip to implant inside his robot. It's an emotion chip that reacts to his rage. He has a lot of anger issues because he, he just couldn't handle the fact that people have changed a little bit, but he just can't handle it. Can't handle bro, you can lift. Look at those giant robots. Guess what happens? You guessed it. OP, OP, OP. Yeah, here's the thing I kind of need to say about that. Oh, that, um, if I blast the rider kick, why doesn't he expand a little bit more and take out everybody around? Like it did, like it did it before. It cuts down buildings. <laughs> I mean, come on, it cut, it, it almost cut a stadium down and a, bu and a building across from it and all. You know, I kind of pictured something. What if I blast it, right? You take the, you take the, uh, you take the Fi's chip out, right? While the Fi's phone is still hooked up to the, uh, the Fi's blaster, right? What if you took it out and plugged it into your, your sword you get from AutoVision? We get it, Kuga. We get it. That ass is getting whipped because you made me drive back and forth. <laughs> of course, that happens. <laughs> Kuga, you're 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 gonna get it. You gonna get it. You gonna get that. You gonna get it. You gonna get it. I get that whipping stick out. I get that whipping stick out. Mm. I'm going mafia mode. Like even if I'm super climax, super climax heroes, I'll go mafia mode. Come here. Come here. I'm going mafia mode. Let's go. Anywho. I'm still debating on this because I want to watch Die Ranger, but I want to watch the TV Neon version because they remastered the damn thing. Not only that, but I also want to watch Agito from TV Neon. But, you know, we can't always get our way. The Die Ranger from TV Neon's already been completed, but Agito is not. It's that weird thing. Agito is the only one that's not completed. <laughs> So I think Team Ninaha needs to hurry the hell up and complete it so I can watch it. If not, then I'll just, uh, you know, go get it from the usual old site I get it on and... You seen that fight? I mean, not fight. You seen that Kuga? That's what making me run back and forth. Now I gotta go back. <laughs> and run into a mine. Yeah. I run into a lot of things. This is what happens when you drunk drive, kids! You seen that little spin I did? Kugo, why don't you punch the damn thing? Punch him! Punch it! 
Punch it in the face! Ugh. I hate that thing. It's like Navi. Come on, punch him in the face. Hey, hey, you, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> or squish it or something. I don't know. Ugh. Coming to the end of the video already. Anywho. I know if I miss a lot of things, let me know in the comments below. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. God bless and aloha.